Because clearly, Ant-Man is fast enough, why am I not getting away? Apparently if both can't get away, it doesn't count. Just want to check that item. Hmm. Acid armor, huh? No, that shouldn't matter, because it was already a ride on. Fuckers is next. Rude on Route 18. I need Waterfall. Oh, wait, no. Route 18, no. Route 14, I do. So. Shit. I will need Surf, though. Surf, I'm not giving to anyone on the main team, though. If Cherno can learn that or Waterfall, I'll be happy. Can I'll learn Waterfall. How about Surf? Cherno can learn Surf. Huh. That is one of the least expected HM slaves. And actually, if I can teach Tornadus or Thunderous Waterfall, then that'd be perfect. Because that means I would only have to kick two people off the team. I'm on Route 18, and then the last one's on Route 14. Oh shit, that's right. Right Dawn is still asleep. Do I have any awakenings? No, but I have full heals, whatever. Close enough. And it, actually, it's the six Stooges because you never find Getsis. And of course, N fucking flies the coop, so. Okay, seriously, when did this cross over from Route 17 to 18? I, di I still didn't see it this time. Oh, another Lapaberry. Nice. If I cared about holdable ethers at this point in the game, I should actually probably come in here, eh, here and heal. Do I have anything this idiot wants? Nope. Well, like I said in the private message there on Kafuka, it's gonna take me a while to get to the point where I can really slot it into my schedule. 
Because after this, uh, Nuzlocke, well, it's not a Nuzlocke anymore, but after this I got Black Toon and I got a couple requested Pokemon projects. And I'm still really early in Earthbound right now on YouTube, so it's gonna be a while. Yeah, the only thing that can hit this thing super effectively is uh, Razor Shell. Which isn't necessary. I just said that I'm going to. Or at least I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, the only thing left in Terraria for me to do is the <coughs> fucking uh, angler quests, which are obnoxious. Like I even gave my, I used an inventory editor because I didn't feel like going and doing all that fucking fishing, because I hate fishing mini games in any fucking game I play. And. Fly up to Upper Lucid City. I know you can see that I've been to Village Bridge and fucking Undela Town, but it's because I was using a walkthrough wall cheat to uh, check if <clears throat> using just two random ass fucking Tornadus and Thunderous would count. Use the mouse real quick. Let's put Bonzi Buddy on the team. Damn it, I want to put him next to. Let's kick Snuggles off the team and Hellhound off the team. And let's put Bonzi up front. And because they're like level four. And let's check wa uh, waterfall real quick. No, I don't want ominous wind. Hey, they both can. Tundurus or Whirly Bird? Who do I want to have learn it? No, let's give it to Tundurus. Not that it matters. And let's go for a Pokemon Outbreak on Route 2. Don't care. And for the record, I haven't fought anyone out here, so... There's that. Oh, hey, Sawsbuck. Of course I can get away. So many useless items. I'm not even going to try to read that. That's French, I think. Isn't this guy supposed to have a rock and roller? Because this is the po supposed to be the part of the game where you're like, holy shit, these enemies are strong! Oh yeah, that's supposed to be missing. Oh, 
Artisan Sonya. Oh wow, Simmy's here. I'm waking in my boots. What's Hal gonna do? <laughs> oh wow, your plus two attack puts you on the same footing as my natural attack. Just because huge power gives me an automatic plus two. It's passive. Not sure why I went for Razor Shell there. It's probably gonna survive now. Oh wow. Game loves giving me those. Now that it doesn't fucking matter. What with, you know, PP max on everything. Ooh, that's actually a good TM. Something like that would put fucking Rydonna in her place. Eh, Hyper Potion is not exciting. That wasn't a jarring transition to nighttime at all. Another foreign person? Yep. So many gems. Don't want to bother them to fight all these trainers, I don't know. I don't remember how many battles there are in Village Bridge, which is up next. I might just skip over it. Don't think there's anything of importance there. Well, time to switch uh, right on off the lead. challenge in these fights. Damn it. 
Dawn Fan. Almost level 60 Dawn Fan. Holy shit. If only I could have come out here legally and fucking did grinding. During the actual game and great experience shared that I don't fucking care about. Because that's the third one the game has given me. The experience share becomes useless after fucking... What? The first one? Anything beyond that, the experience share is just splitting the experience way too fucking much. Oh yeah, that's right. Villager Village Bridge has fucking wild Pokemon in it. Oh wow, she's got a full fucking party. What? But it's all a bunch of weak shit. And why is Redona still in the lead? Wow, I still got a one-hit kill on a fucking resisted attack. This is a waste of my time. Wait, Cascoon's only bug type? I thought it picked up poison. Oh wow, Kadabra, the one almost threatening thing on this team. Gunk shot, bloof. Eh, gunk shot's not gonna do shit because, you know. No physical attack on Kadabra. Hmm, if this is 350 cup rules, then I'd be fucking scared of Clefairy. But it's not, so I'm not. Here, rustling grass. I see the rustling grass. And I didn't get to it. Fuck you, Yuxi. Fuck it, I'm skipping. Because there's nothing here. A couple trainer battles. Whoop de doo. I did remember that I wanted to hit level 65 with the party. Max and Joe would have been funnier if it was Sam and Max.
I usually don't like using Flare Blitz. Now I wanted Infernape for the joke of the name. Why did I pick it over? Oh yeah, adaptability. That's right. It was either uh, Infernape or Darmanitan. And Infernape had the better ability. Excuse me. Infernape had the better ability. I don't remember what Darmanitan had. Yeah. But that's not the joke I wanted to go for. If only shiny Infernape was purple, I would have. That would have just made for you know perfect complement to the joke. Oh wow, that was a critical hit. Moving on. Why would I rely on one experience point per step? That's just stupid. Oh my god. Yep, you go for the fucking water ground, being super effective on fire. Ha, I got a grass move, asshole. Yeah, these guys aren't fighting worth fighting either. These guys aren't worth fighting either. Ooh, a citrus berry. Oh my. Kombi's supposed to appear here. Zero out of ten. Focus band? Didn't even realize that was still an item. Well, with the fact that Focus Sash does exactly what it does, but better. Does this kid have anything for me? Nope! Everything is level 60 plus, but everything's a fucking basic! Which just makes me wonder what the hell's the point? Why soup up the enemy levels if you're gonna just roll back what the fucking experience values are? Fuck, I'd prefer if you just give me a fucking bunch of blissies. And I wouldn't waste as many fuck. waste as much fucking time. 
This route's a waste of my time. Lakunosa Town. Gonna be worth fighting? Probably not. Oh, look at tongue. Not terrible. Are you retarded, Lickton? Yeah, let's use Ember on the fire type. Dingus. I was about to say, is that gonna be three critical hits in a row? Fuck you too, game. Frenzy plant. Shit ninja, really? Gonna force me to use it, huh? Guess I could have used crunch, but whatever. Technicality. Why not use fucking Flare Blitz when the recoil is only gonna be one damage? 